All right, so I'm not even gonna set the camera up and turn all the lights on for this. I'm just gonna talk straight to the camera. Tasha K wants to be broke. She wants to be just without a future, without anything to leave for her kids, which is super annoying to me after all she's done and everything she's built and she has a wonderful family. She's lost her ever loving mind. Tasha K has lost her ever loving mind for letting that guy get on there and make those claims about Will Smith. Listen, it has been an industry rumor for years that Will Smith is gay. That is, that's not news. It's not important. I don't care. But when you have a man get on your platform and say the things that he said, the way that he said them, is it's no longer gossip. It is just disgusting defamation and rumors. Like, and listen, everybody, he's like, well, Tasha Kay's a gossip blogger. Tasha, Tasha Kay's a gossip blogger. There are lines for gossip bloggers. There's a way to look at somebody and, and hear their story and go, mm, this is this is a bag of BS. I'm not going to put this on my platform. It's not, it's not even worth it. It's not even reputable news. It's not even... I'm sorry, I'm getting tongue-tied because I'm trying to describe what this is. It just seems like slander and goofy stuff. It just seems like slander and goofy stuff when it comes to the the um, the rumors about Dwayne Martin and, and Will Smith having sex. And, and, and the guy saying that he was killing it. Like, all that is completely unnecessary, you know? Tasha K should have learned from the Cardi B situation. She still owes Cardi B $4 million, and now she's trying to kiss Cardi B's butt to get out of it. And I hope Cardi B doesn't fall for it, especially after what's going on with Will Smith. You see that Car that Tasha K doesn't care. It doesn't matter who she hurts, the fames, whatever. It does not matter to her as long as she's doing clicks, can, clicks and views, and that's extremely dangerous. We saw that recently on a smaller scale with um, the girl she put on with Candace's husband, Candace from Real House with the Potomac's husband. Nobody believed that. Nobody believed that drunk girl on on the on the um on on her show it was just it was really petty stupid the girl was just a fan who didn't like candace and that was obvious it this is just it, it just is disturbing to me that tasha k just won't stop you can do gossip there's a ton of gossip in the world there are people like um british williams going to jail for four years for fraud there's a lot of gossip out there that people want to know the tea on that's real gossip and got real stories hey this whole tamar braxton thing with krishan that's gossip this situation with will smith just seems like slander and kicking somebody while he's down especially after everybody has seen his wife's whole book tour it's just frustrating he's already at a weird point in his career after the Oscar slap, his wife puts a book out. He puts a book out. His wife has, you know, talked about Tupac for years and years and years. And now here you come <clears throat> wanting to tear him down more. And even funnier, she had this whole rant about Joe Budden not supporting black people and not supporting other black podcasts. Well, ho, what do you think you're doing? You're not supporting black people by doing this, by putting this rumor out. You did that whole screaming rant in the car, Tasha K, screaming at Joe Budden, calling him a loser, saying he doesn't support black women, saying he doesn't support other black people. What the hell do you think you're doing right now? This isn't supporting black people. This isn't supporting a, a, a black man. This isn't supporting a black creative, especially a, a black man who hasn't done anything to anybody. Yes, he did the Oscar slap. It was awful. But outside of that, what has Will Smith done to anybody for you to be putting mess like this out? And I'm sorry, I don't normally get offended and annoyed with drama that's put out there on social media or YouTube, but this really pissed me off. So Tasha, whatever you get at this point, they are talking about suing the Smiths, Will Smith literally black Hollywood elite, the black Hollywood elite. It's Will Smith, it's Samuel Jackson, it's Denzel. Those are your black elites at the very top. Maybe you're Angela Bassett, but those are your, your black elites. You are about to get sued by them and they will win because what you're going to have to do is prove that what that guy said was true. So that means you're going to have to have Dwayne Martin, or Will Smith come out and say that, that that was true or have proof that it was true to prove that the de that it wasn't defamation and you're not going to be able to do that. I, I, it's so dumb. It's dumb, Tasha. You're dumb. You have ruined your own platform. Listen, and then listen, this is the end of the video. I'm going to get off. I'm annoyed now. I'm frustrated and I still have more work I got to do. But